The profession of a firefighter has long been in the top of the most dangerous professions. It is no secret that not everyone can withstand such stresses both psychological and physical. Therefore, becoming a firefighter, you must be prepared for anything because all people of the fire profession know that the bright flames do not accept the weak and the cowards, but only those who have a hardened heart. The New Orleans firefighters would agree with those words. More than once, they have had to fight terrible fires and show unprecedented bravery in the fight against the fire. There have been times when these men have risked their own lives to save someone else's, and they never expect much reward for that, but they continue to do their job, saving people from the traps of fire. One day, a report was received on the dispatcher's desk that a fire had broken out in a residential home. Supposedly, the fire occurred in the children's room, and there were young children in the house at the time. All of this was reported by a neighbor who saw the fire. Firefighters arrived to the location five minutes later and immediately made a plan of action, after which they immediately set out to implement it. Some began to extinguish the flames, while two experienced employees were sent to the burning house to rescue the trapped victims. By that time, the smoke had filled the room and the firefighters struggled to find the children. The only thing that saved them was oxygen masks, which the children did not have. That meant their chances of survival in this hell were slipping away by the minute. Even so, the men kept looking and hoping, believing they would succeed. Suddenly, the radio told them to go back within minutes because the fire had reached its highest point and the house was about to collapse. If they did not return in the specified time, they would be buried alive under the rubble. But what about the children? After all, their parents are out there waiting and worried. The men decided to go all the way. And no one knows how this story might have ended if suddenly a persistent sound, very much like a mewing, came out of nowhere. It grew louder and weaker but did not cease for a moment. The rescue men instinctively followed this strange call and when they reached the room from which the sound came, it was already engulfed in a thick smoke. The firefighters wouldn't have noticed the children lying on the floor at all, but that's when the furry landlady came to their rescue. Firefighters were about to leave the room believing that no one was there, but at that very moment the cat began to pull on the pants of one of the rescuers. At the same second, the oxygen masks were put on the kids, and then they began to take them out of this terrible captivity, not forgetting the fluffy little hero. Literally a minute after everyone was safely out in the air, the roof of the house collapsed and then everyone realized that the rescuers with the children were on the edge of death. The kids had gotten a lot of smoke inhalation, but there was no further danger to their health, unlike that cat named Meg who had fallen unconscious in the arms of the firefighter. The cat had to be rescued immediately, so she was treated as well. Using a special small oxygen mask, Meg came to her senses a few minutes later. As one of the fire department officials later said, the cat should join our team for it was her heroic behavior that saved both the children and the firefighters. A picture of Meg with an oxygen mask on her face was found on the internet, and within a few days, this picture was spread all over the world and how a cat could not lose consciousness before the rescuers arrived, it's still a mystery, but it does not matter. The main thing is that everyone remained unharmed. In turn, parents who went to the pharmacy just for a few minutes sure that if not for Meg, all would have ended badly, and people on social networks called her the guardian angel of the children. Who knows, maybe this time the angel really did have a mustache and a red tail. That's all for today. Write your comments on what you think about this story. Also, rate the video and talk to you soon.